I'll show you how I remove caps from a circuit board. So I'm going to take this cap out right here. What I'm going to do is I flip the board over and get my index finger on top of that cap. I'm going to heat up the traces on the other side where the cap comes through. I'm going to rock it back and forth depending on which side I heat up. Keep that trace up right there. Just rock it out that way. Heat up that trace. Rock it back the other way. Go back to this trace. There we go. It's the easiest way to get a capacitor off the board. Now, Take my solder sucker. Suck the solder out of the vias where the cap used to sit. We're ready to put a new cap in. Now sometimes the solder sucker won't remove the solder from the vias. So you can take solder wick, and you can pull the solder out that way. Sometimes, if you can't get the solder from the vias with the solder wick or the solder sucker, you take you one of these little drill bit kits and drill down through the solder so you can make a hole for your new capacitor to go through that via. Let's try it again. We'll take this cap out right here. up that lead right there, rock that cap back, heat this one up, rock it the other way, heat that one up right there, there's our capacitor, now go ahead and remove the solder from the vias. That one's not coming undone. Try the solder wick. Almost got it. Let's go to the other side. There it is. That's why it's not coming out. This is a thick trace right here. It must be ground. So let's go ahead and take our drill. And I'm going to drill the solder out of that via. There we go. Now we have a hole in that via. that we can install a new capacitor.